Psalm 43 Prayer for Help Vindicate me, God, and plead my case against an ungodly nation. Save me from the deceitful and unjust person, for you are the God of my strength. Why have you rejected me? Why do I go about mourning because of the oppression of the enemy? Send out your light and your truth, they shall lead me. They shall bring me to your holy hill and to your dwelling places. Then I will go to the altar of God, to God my exceeding joy. And I will praise you on the lyre, God my God. Why are you in despair, my soul? And why are you restless within me? Wait for God. For I will again praise him for the help of his presence, my God. Psalm 44 Former Times of Help and Present Troubles For the Music Director A Masculine of the Sons of Korah God, we have heard with our ears, our fathers have told us the work that you did in their days, in the days of old. You with your own hand drove out the nations, then you planted them. You afflicted the peoples, then you let them go free. For by their own sword they did not possess the land, and their own arm did not save them. But your right hand and your arm and the light of your presence, for you favored them. You are my king, God. Command victories for Jacob. Through you we will push back our adversaries. Through your name we will trample down those who rise up against us. For I will not trust in my bow, nor will my sword save me. But you have saved us from our adversaries, and you have put to shame those who hate us. In God we have boasted all day long, and we will give thanks to your name forever. Selah yet you have rejected us and brought us to dishonor, and do not go out with our armies. You cause us to turn back from the enemy, and those who hate us have taken spoils for themselves. You turn us over to be eaten like sheep, and have scattered us among the nations. You sell your people cheaply, and have not profited by their sale. You make us an object of reproach to our neighbors, of scoffing and ridicule to those around us. You make us a proverb among the nations, a laughingstock among the peoples. All day long my dishonor is before me and I am covered with my humiliation, because of the voice of one who taunts and reviles, because of the presence of the enemy and the avenger. All this has come upon us, but we have not forgotten you, and we have not dealt falsely with your covenant. Our heart has not turned back, and our steps have not deviated from your way, yet you have crushed us in a place of jackals and covered us with deep darkness. If we had forgotten the name of our God or extended our hands to a strange God, would God not find this out? For he knows the secrets of the heart. But for your sake we are killed all day long. We are regarded as sheep to be slaughtered. Wake yourself up, why do you sleep, Lord? Awake, do not reject us forever. Why do you hide your face and forget our affliction and oppression? For our souls have sunk down into the dust. Our bodies cling to the earth. Rise up, be our help and redeem us because of your mercy. Psalm 45 A Song Celebrating the King's Marriage For the Music Director According to the Shoshanim A Masculine of the Sons of Korah A Song of Love My heart is moved with a good theme. I address my verses to the king. My tongue is the pen of a ready writer. You are the most handsome of the sons of mankind. Grace is poured upon your lips. Therefore God has blessed you forever. Strap your sword on your thigh, mighty one, in your splendor and majesty, and in your majesty ride on victoriously, for the cause of truth, humility, and righteousness. Let your right hand teach you awesome things. Your arrows are sharp, the peoples fall under you. Your arrows are in the heart of the king's enemies. Your throne, God, is forever and ever. The scepter of your kingdom is a scepter of justice. You have loved righteousness and hated wickedness. Therefore God, your God, has anointed you with the oil of joy above your companions. All your garments are fragrant with myrrh, aloes, and cassia. From ivory palaces stringed instruments have made you joyful. King's daughters are among your noble women. At your right hand stands the queen in gold from Ophir. Listen, daughter, look and incline your ear. Forget your people and your father's house. Then the king will crave your beauty because he is your Lord, bow down to him. The daughter of Tyre will come with a gift. The wealthy among the people will seek your favor. The king's daughter is all glorious within. Her clothing is interwoven with gold. She will be brought to the king in colorful garments. The virgins, her companions who follow her, 
will be brought to you. They will be brought with joy and rejoicing. They will enter into the king's palace. In place of your fathers will be your sons. You shall make them princes in all the earth. I will make your name known among all generations. Therefore the peoples will praise you forever and ever. Psalm 46 God, the refuge of his people. For the music director. A psalm of the sons of Korah, set to Alamoth. A song. God is our refuge and strength, a very ready help in trouble. Therefore we will not fear, though the earth shakes and the mountains slip into the heart of the sea, though its waters roar and foam, though the mountains quake at its swelling pride. Selah there is a river whose streams make the city of God happy, the holy dwelling places of the Most High. God is in the midst of her, she will not be moved. God will help her when morning dawns. The nations made an uproar, the kingdoms tottered. He raised his voice, the earth quaked. The Lord of armies is with us. The God of Jacob is our stronghold. Selah. Come, behold the works of the Lord, who has inflicted horrific events on the earth. He makes wars to cease to the end of the earth. He breaks the bow and cuts the spear in two. He burns the chariots with fire. Stop striving and know that I am God. I will be exalted among the nations. I will be exalted on the earth. The Lord of armies is with us. The God of Jacob is our stronghold. Psalm 47 God, the King of the earth. For the music director. A psalm of the sons of Korah. Clap your hands, all you peoples. Shout to God with a voice of joy. For the Lord Most High is to be feared. A great king over all the earth. He subdues peoples under us and nations under our feet. He chooses our inheritance for us the pride of Jacob whom he loves. Selah God has ascended with a shout, the Lord with the sound of a trumpet. Sing praises to God, sing praises. Sing praises to our King, sing praises. For God is the King of all the earth. Sing praises with a psalm of wisdom. God reigns over the nations, God sits on his holy throne. The princes of the people have assembled as the people of the God of Abraham, for the shields of the earth belong to God. He is highly exalted. Psalm 48 The Beauty and Glory of Zion A Song A Psalm of the Sons of Korah Great is the Lord, and greatly to be praised in the city of our God, His holy mountain. Beautiful in elevation the joy of the whole earth is Mount Zion in the far north, the city of the great king. In its palaces God has made Himself known as a stronghold. For behold the kings arrived, they passed by together. They saw it, then they were amazed. They were terrified, they fled in a hurry. Panic seized them there, anguish as that of a woman in childbirth. With the east wind you smash the ships of Tarshish. Just as we have heard, so have we seen in the city of the Lord of Armies, in the city of our God. God will establish her forever. Selah we have thought over your goodness, God, in the midst of your temple. As is your name, God, so is your praise to the ends of the earth. Your right hand is full of righteousness. Mount Zion shall be glad. The daughters of Judah shall rejoice because of your judgments. Walk around Zion and encircle her. Count her towers, consider her ramparts, go through her palaces so that you may tell of her to the next generation. For such is God our God forever and ever. He will lead us until death. Psalm 49 The Foolishness of Trusting in Riches For the Music Director a psalm of the sons of Korah. Hear this, all peoples. Listen, all inhabitants of the world, both low and high, rich and poor together. My mouth will speak wisdom, and the meditation of my heart will be understanding. I will incline my ear to a proverb. I will express my riddle on the harp. Why should I fear in days of adversity, when the injustice of those who betray me surrounds me, those who trust in their wealth and boast in the abundance of their riches? No one can by any means redeem another or give God a ransom for him, for the redemption of his soul is priceless, and he should cease imagining forever, that he might live on eternally, that he might not undergo decay. For he sees that even wise people die. The foolish and the stupid alike perish and leave their wealth to others. Their inner thought is that their houses are forever and their dwelling places to all generations. They have named their lands after their own names. But man in his splendor will not endure. He is like the animals that perish. This is the way of those who are foolish. 
and of those after them who approve their words. Selah like sheep they sink down to Sheol, death will be their shepherd, and the upright will rule over them in the morning, and their form shall be for Sheol to consume so that they have no lofty home. But God will redeem my soul from the power of Sheol, for he will receive me. Selah do not be afraid when a person becomes rich, when the splendor of his house is increased, for when he dies, he will take nothing with him. His wealth will not descend after him. Though while he lives he congratulates himself, and though people praise you when you do well for yourself, he will go to the generation of his fathers. They will never see the light. Mankind in its splendor, yet without understanding, is like the animals that perish.